Hi everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you what I do with all of my old eggshells. I don't throw them away because they have many uses in the garden and I feed them to my chickens as well. Hopefully after you see this video you won't throw away your eggshells either and you'll start putting them in the garden. So before I chop up these eggshells and utilize them in my garden I want to quickly explain some of the benefits of eggshells in your garden. Well, for the first one, a lot of people use these around their plants to stop the snails and slugs. And see all these sharp edges? Snails and slugs hate crawling over these. But here's the best benefits of having eggshells in your soil. Worms need grit in order to help with their digestive system. So once you chop these up super, super fine and mix them in your soil, it's so good for the worms and don't we want to help our worms? Healthier worms means more worm castings to add fertilizer for your garden. Eggshells are also good for chickens. I know that sounds crazy because they laid them. Well, I actually feed them back to my chickens. Here is why. Just like the earthworms, chickens need calcium and grit as well. So what I do is I chop these up super, super fine and I mix it with their food or I sprinkle it around their coop. They ingest the calcium and they lay stronger shelled eggs. I mean, look, the proof is in the pudding. These are strong shells for my chickens. The shell of a chicken egg is comprised of about 96% calcium carbonate. Not only is calcium an essential plant nutrient, but it also moderates soil acidity. Fast growing plants deplete the soil of calcium very quickly. So eggshells are an ideal supplement and food for your garden. Basically, it's free fertilizer. Let me show you how I chop these up and utilize them in my garden. The way I like to chop up my eggshells is by using a nice sharp knife. Now I know a lot of people will use a food processor or one of those fancy grinding machines. That's fine, but for me, <laughs> I don't feel like cleaning that device. It's easier for me just to use a sharp knife so I only have one thing to clean. Keep in mind that if I was using these eggshells to detour the slugs and snails away, I wouldn't chop them up. I would just kind of smash them and put them in the garden just like this. But I'm not using my eggshells for that. Now, if I don't chop up these eggshells, will they decompose in my garden? Yes, of course, but it will take a very long time. So the smaller you can get them, the quicker they will decompose in your garden. Plus, I want the eggshells super fine so the worms can utilize them in their digestive system and also my chickens will be able to eat them a lot easier as well. Okay, now that I got all my eggshells finely chopped up, it's time to put them in the garden and in my chicken coop as well. I just get a little Tupperware container and in they go. Some of these will go inside my chicken's feed and that'll be really good calcium for them. Just mix it in with their food. There you go, girls. Get your calcium and lay those nice, strong shelled eggs. Next, I will sprinkle some on the chicken coop floor. Isn't that right, Smarty Pants? You gonna come up and see me?
And this is how I mix it in my garden soil. I just sprinkle it around and scratch it in. And the rest will go in the compost. So the next time you make breakfast and crack open those eggs, think twice before you put those shells in the garbage. There's many uses for eggshells in your garden and in the chicken coop as well. Isn't that right, Smarty Pants? <laughs> Thanks for watching.